Okay, coach, uh, how could you review our preseason camp in Kielce? How are these days in Poland? Well, listen, the, the, the most important thing, we didn't have any, any, let's say, serious problems, serious injuries. We have some uh, players that they have, uh, they have some flu or virus, maybe some small, small injuries. But uh, we are happy that, especially now after the, the pre-season, we have uh, uh, all the players available for practice. And uh, I think we have uh, also what is very important, we have good conditions to, to prepare well, to practice well, and also what is very important for me to build up uh, the team chemistry. And so I think uh, it was uh, quite successful. How could you describe our games there? I think uh, it was uh, uh, progressive. What is also very important for me and what makes me happy, you know, that uh, from each game you could see that we develop and that we build uh, build up something uh, something uh, new. So I think that uh, the most important thing for me that the team accept the, the way we want to play, the model of the game. And now it's just about improving. That's always about the details, how we want to improve with and without the ball. I think we are on a, on a, on a good track. In which aspects of game do you satisfy the most? Oh, uh, it's difficult to, to, to separate those things because uh, I always see the football as one uh, whole, whole part. So there is no things that you can say, yeah, we did this good and this bad because it's, everything is connected. If you don't press good, you will not have enough uh, balls for you. And if you don't defend well, of course, you will have less opportunity to attack. So everything is connected. I think uh, in general we did uh, uh, pretty good things, especially uh, with the idea what we want to do. So now it's about uh, technical and tactical things and improvements in those, as I said, small details. But I cannot put uh, anything. Uh, I think in, in general it's, it's okay. It is still one and a half week till the season start. But uh, do you have a concept of starting 11 in your head? But no, I think it's still uh, 10 days. Uh, there is obviously a group of the players who are from the first day with us and the group of players who, uh, let's say, uh, advance more than others. So it is always the same. From my experience, you have some group players who accepted the new, uh, new demands faster, especially on the tactical level. And then you have a second group of players who need a little bit more time. But as I said to, to all of them, I most of the time I use a rotation system and uh, all of them will get minutes. It is not important who will start because uh, I know very well that football it's not about uh, 11 players. The football it's about 20, 25 players and the football is about the team. So there is nothing, no important who will start, the who will be the best. Depending also every game will be some maybe different uh, tactical aspect or approach for certain positions. But in general, I think they all de deserve the, the chance. So now only depends how many minutes they will get and uh, who will start. It only depends on the last days, uh, last week. And yeah, we still have time. Were these days really helpful to build a team spirit and boost team morale? I think uh, yes, but uh, pre-season is one, one thing. It's one part. Now the always is uh, the good when you start the season to have a good results and to improve on those results. I am very aware that we will have good and bad days, good and bad games. But uh, from every game we have to take something new and to build uh, according to, to results or the specially performance that we have. So I think uh, we have quite good now team spirit and the chemistry in the team I really like at, at this moment.